A lot of people have heard the claim that Martin Luther, the premier and first Protestant reformer, uh, was suspicious about the book of James, wasn't sure it should be in the, the canon of the New Testament, and often uh, it is attributed to the fact that uh, he repeatedly says faith without works is dead, and people understand that Luther was the great champion of justification by grace through faith uh, in an age of medieval Catholicism that was very work-centered. In fact, uh, Luther's hermeneutic for uh, the New Testament canon, his principle of interpretation was uh, whatever most clearly preached Christ was most central. And James only makes two references in passing in chapter 1, 1 and 2, 1 to Christ by name, though he has countless allusions to Jesus' teaching, and there are places where he refers to the Lord that probably don't just or even mean God the Father, but refer to Jesus. But for this reason, uh, Luther wondered, though never actually proposed that uh, James not be included in the canon. In fact, uh, this is a rich book complimenting uh, Paul and other biblical authors on topics like faith, like works, and even like uh, the person and nature of Christ when you uh, read more carefully.